Hello and welcome to your episode review of episode 3 of Doctor Who series 14 slash season 1. Boom. Written by Stephen Moffat. Let's get into it, shall we? Um, first off, I really enjoyed this episode. I thought it was a triumphant return of the Moff to the Hooniverse. Um, we saw it with the Doctor and how he portrays the character in this episode that he, you know, the storyline is that he's on a forbidden planet. Um, and that he, you know, in the midst of trying to find something, um, the TARDIS lands on this planet and he steps on a bomb and any sudden movement will set it off. So, in a way, it's kind of a, how do you say, a Dr. Light episode in that sense because, you know, he spends the entire episode stood on a bomb while um, trying to figure out things uh, relating to the planet, trying to stop impending doom by blowing up everything, and um, I think this is kind of the start of the Dr. Light episodes for me. In that sense, um, you, we know at this point possible that Trudy Gatwa was away filming sex education at the time, and hence his schedule didn't quite match up with Doctor Who, so they had to come up with a workaround in order to combat that and this was I think the beginning of the Dr. Light episodes. Obviously in 73 Yards it's started to become more apparent that this is a Dr. Light episode in the sense that it's a companion story um, but I'll get into that more uh, next week with my review. Um, yeah, a return to form for Moffat for this one. Really enjoyed the storyline. Uh, we had the new companion for season 2 introduced here, albeit playing a different character and I'm looking forward to seeing what charismatic uh, personalities she brings to the companions uh, in season 2 for that role. Um, and very interesting as well with how the storyline evolves around the characters and what it means possibly for the future of the series. So. Overall, a solid return from Moff, for Moffat for um, the return to the Hooniverse. Really enjoyed this episode and looking forward to more from him in the future. Um, yeah, really enjoyed this episode and I just hope that the series can take an onward trajectory um, as the series goes on. Because um, as you know, my thoughts on The Devil's Chord was not great. Um, but yeah, we brushed past that and we dealt with it in the episode review. However, uh, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again very soon for more. If you like this video, click below to comment on it, subscribe to the channel for more content like this and uh, share the video on social platforms. I'll be grateful for all your support. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again very soon.